everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much as always for joining me. I can now officially say that autumn is upon us. It's now the end of September, approaching October, and let me tell you I am so excited. October is like my favourite month of the year, apart from my birthday in January, obviously. I just love October. I am such a Halloween autumn girl. I just love everything about autumn. I love the weather, the like crisp cold air. I love wrapping up all cosy. I love the beautiful coloured leaves on the ground. Obviously Halloween is a big factor. I'm such a big kid. I just love Halloween. I always have. There's just something about Halloween that is very nostalgic for me. I feel like we've got a cosy vibe going on today got my black nails, we've got the autumnal candle burning, I've got my lovely Starbucks pumpkin cup, which I love. And if I may say so myself, I have a really great haul for you guys today with really gorgeous autumn pieces from Zara. So without further ado, go grab yourself a drink, a tea, a coffee, a pumpkin spice latte, a glass of vino, get yourself a nice snack because we've got a lot to get through today. So, without further ado, if you would like to see what I picked up from Zara this week, then please do keep watching. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and grab the very first thing from my massive Zara box. And the first thing that I picked up was a jumper. So I picked up this beautiful crochet knit jumper in a beautiful like, probably like a rusty brown, I would say this probably is rusty brown. It's absolutely beautiful I loved this straight away as soon as I saw it on the website I thought it was absolutely gorgeous just a crew neck it has slightly sort of bubbled sleeves nothing too oversized oh they're not even pulled out properly sorry um they look like this nothing too oversized but that sort of nice balloon effect and I absolutely love this. This colour is so autumnal, so gorgeous. I think this colour literally suits everyone, every single skin tone, every single hair colour. I just think it's a really beautiful shade and just perfect for autumn. I picked mine up in a size medium and it was $32.99. As always, I will insert cutaways so that you can see everything on. And of course, everything will be linked down below as it always is. And... I'm doing so well today <laughs> and for reference if you've never watched my videos before I am typically a size 8 and I'm 5 foot tall. Anyway back to the jumper. I think I'm going to pair this with a pair of blue or black jeans and some boots or maybe even some faux leather shorts and chunky boots. I feel like that would look absolutely gorgeous or at least it does in my head. So fingers crossed it looks as good on as I think it will, but I absolutely love this. I think it's so, so gorgeous and I'm so, so happy with this. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this next item. This is one of those things that I saw and I literally instantly put in my bag. Um, I just knew that it was gonna look good. It's just so me, it's so my style. Everything that I like, I just love it. So I actually picked up a dress. You won't see it very well until you see the try on clip, but I will show you anyway. It is a black velvet dress with slightly puffed sleeves. There's actually something in there that's making them puffy. Um, if I put my hand in, yeah, it's like a little bit of sponge inside. So there, there's just a tiny bit of uh, shoulder on there. Um, obviously it's got this gorgeous high neck, like frilly high neck. These have beautiful sleeves, oh my God. Oh, how gorgeous are these sleeves with the beautiful like, um, is it called a bell sleeve? I always forget the name of these types of sleeve, trumpet sleeve. I just love them so much. That type of sleeve is everything that I just, everything that I love. Um, very like Victoriana and slightly old fashioned, but I like old fashioned. I think old fashioned is coming back in. Like I think old is the new new, you know? 
Anyway, um, I love this so much. It's a mini dress. It's such a nice length. It has um, a slight waistband, although it's nothing tight. It doesn't like cinch in or anything like that. Um, it does up at the back with a zip. And I just love it so much. Um, when I tried this on, I instantly fell in love. I'm not exactly sure which shoes I'm gonna wear with it. Probably just like black heeled boots, I think. But I think this dress is so beautifully made. It feels gorgeous, so luxurious. And I know that this is such, oh my God, like this is just such a perfect piece for me to have in my wardrobe for autumn, um, for an event, an occasion. It's subtle, it's gorgeous, I love it. Um, I got mine in a size small and it was 49.99. So it wasn't cheap, but to be honest, I do think this dress is worth 50 pounds. I think it's beautiful. Next up, I picked up a skort and it's a gorgeous tartan skort. Again, perfect for autumn. Such autumnal colors with this like muted brown and the orange and the blue. Um, I love this skort. It does look extremely short and to be honest, it is even on me um, and I'm very short. It's pretty, sh it's pretty short but it is short, not a skirt. So as you can see, the back looks like short, the front looks like a skirt. So it is something I feel like you can get away with because it's not a skirt. Um, how many times can I say the same thing in just like 5,000 different ways? Anyway, you get the point. It's really short, but it's so cute. Um, and I love it. I think it's so subtle and just so girly, very preppy and this is very my style it's something that i know i would be able to wear get the use out of this is something you could even wear to work if your work isn't too formal um with obviously with tights and some boots and i just think maybe like a turtleneck jumper with this would look really lovely and formal and classic um or you can just pair it with like a like a light jumper slightly tucked in at the front but yeah, I think this is so lovely. Really, really happy with it. I think I've done the belt up too tight. It's making it go all funny. But you get the gist um, with this like tiny, like narrow belt. So, so cute. It does up in a zip at the side. And I'm a really big fan of this skort. Really big fan. So you'll see on the try on clip what it looks like. Um, I got mine again in a size small and this was 25.99. And then I actually picked something up that I originally thought I would pair with that. And they do go so well together, the skort with this jumper. Um, but as I said, you can also wear that skort with so many other things. As I said, I think a black turtleneck would look really nice with it. But I initially had this in mind to pair with it and it does look really good uh, together. So I picked up a cream, slightly um, high neck, it's sort of a mock neck um, jumper, sweater, whatever you want to call it. So soft um, and like lightweight and just loose and just so lovely. This is so autumnal and obviously perfect for winter as well. It will keep you so lovely and warm. Um, it's super thick but still doesn't feel like too much. It's sort of got that nice like loose loose feeling about it while still keeping you warm and i think this is such a nice transitional piece and i got this in a size medium so it was slightly oversized and it was 29.99 so the next thing i picked up and this was actually something that wasn't my favorite online i just really liked it i thought it was really unusual um, and it looked just like a really beautiful color and pattern but when i put it on oh my gosh i fell in love it's one of those items i put on and I instantly said, wow. And I feel like when you have that wow moment with something and you know you're gonna love it and feel amazing when you put it on, that's when you know you should keep it. So I picked up this top, this top, um, which looks like absolutely nothing like this. You cannot possibly see how beautiful this is just from me holding it up like this, but you will see it in the try on clip. Let me tell you, this top may be one of the nicest, most flattering tops I've put on my body in a really long time. Firstly, the pattern and the colour. Oh my gosh, how gorgeous and autumnal. Very like bohemian. Oh, it's just gorgeous. All these like burnt, like burnt colours, burnt orange, burgundy, dark, dark, dark green, dark blue. It's just the most beautiful colourway ever. And... 
I just, wow. And I just love the pattern. It's so, so stunning. And it wasn't cheap. It was 50 pounds. I got it in a size small, but I honestly think this was worth every single penny for how I, for how it looks. I just think it is so beautifully made. Just the way it hangs on your body, the way that like the waistband, that's not the waistband, that's the sleeve. The way that the waistband like sits, like sits is so flattering. It's kind of like right, like right at the bottom of my tummy. Like it kind of hugs. I can't really explain, but hopefully you can see in the trial clip just how gorgeous this is. I'm probably gonna wear this, I think, with either blue or black um, bell bottom jeans, like flared jeans and some boots and maybe a hat, who knows. Anyway, this is chef's kiss. I love it so much. Favorite thing I've bought in Zara for such a long time. So, so happy with this. And I'm a million percent gonna be keeping this and wearing this to death. And then I've got a couple more dressy pieces. So I picked up this skirt. Oh my God, the labels are always in the front. I picked up this skirt, um, which I did not think I would ever find something like this in Zara, because it's very un-Zara, I feel like, or maybe it is, but I don't think it looks like something that Zara usually does. But it's like this A-line skirt with this like diamond-y, rhinestone like crisscross detail at the bottom with this like v at the front i'm explaining this so badly but you can see it for yourselves it's oh my gosh it's so sparkly and so pretty very glamorous and i just feel like for the party season i don't know i feel like maybe maybe zara may have made a mistake bringing this out in autumn instead of bringing it out in like december because when people are looking for like new year's and christmas day outfits hello like this is perfect um this is like exactly the sort of thing that i would wear either on christmas day or on christmas eve if i went out with my friends um which a lot of the time i do or for new year's day i mean this is just so perfect i haven't decided a hundred percent how i'm gonna style it I think it will probably look best um, with some sort of like cropped black halter neck um, or maybe like a sheer black blouse tucked in with just like a bra or something or maybe some sort of bodysuit could look really beautiful but yeah I just thought this was too gorgeous to pass up I mean it's so nicely made the material is like lovely and thick and will like cinch you in um and really really impressed and i like that the the panel of the rhinestones is is smooth if that makes sense they don't like stick out they're not um how do you explain it like they're not going to catch on anything they're like a smooth rhinestone if that makes sense probably doesn't god i feel like i'm talking absolute shite today but anyway love this oh sorry i forgot to tell you the price I love this so much. Um, I got it in a size small and it was 45 99 So again, it wasn't like a, on the cheaper end of the Zara spectrum, but I do think this is worth it. It's really, really well made and really unusual and kind of looks like Opoly if you ask me. And next up, we have another sort of party piece, although it depends how you style it, because this is the sort of thing that could either be worn going out for like a party, um, or like a dinner, it just depends what footwear you would put with it because I know there's so many different ways to style something like this. I will show you guys and you will see what I mean. So I picked up a dress and it looks like this. Um, it's a mini dress and it's a, is it? I don't think it's black. Mm, actually, maybe it is black. I think it is black. It's a black mini dress with pinstripes. They're very faint, if you can see. There we go. Yeah, so they're very faint pinstripes and obviously these chunky buttons all down the middle. This is like very 60s vibe, very twiggy. Um, it has a slight sort of like curved, um, curved hem at the top. Obviously it's super mini, even on me it's short. So if you're a very, very tall gal, you may want to reconsider or wear shorts underneath. Um, but beautifully made. It feels sort of like a blazer, like a thick blazer material. And it does up with a zip down the side, an invisible zip. 
and I'm really, really impressed with the quality of this. I think it's really beautifully made. However, it's quite spelly. Um, I got mine in a size small and this was 79.99. So it was an 80 pound dress and don't get me wrong, 80 pounds is an expensive for an item of clothing, but me, but for an item of clothing for Zara, that's pretty expensive. You know, it's different if it was from like a higher end brand. Um, like this is the sort of thing actually, I would like, I wouldn't be surprised if I saw this on Farfetch. Like it, it does look very designer-esque, but I do think 80 pounds for Zara is quite steep for a dress, you know, especially when their coats are like 90. So I'm not really sure why it was so expensive, but you guys will see in the try on clip that it is actually a really beautiful piece. And I think with some boots um, and loads of jewelry, it would look gorgeous. And in fairness, this would look cool with trainers too. You could make it really like cool and edgy and put like a, a jacket and some socks and trainers. Um, but again, I probably would dress this up because I think that's just more the look I'd be going for. I really like this. Not sure if it's worth 80 pounds. But I do, I do like it. And now for the start of the show, I got a coat. Um, as you can see, I got a big, fluffy, gorgeously soft, um, kind of a mushroom colour. Mushroom? Let's go with mushroom. A mushroom, minky colour coat. Obviously not made of mink. That would be very expensive. Anyway, this is just, mm, it's so nice. This fabric, I love this sort of faux fur when it's like ultra, ultra soft, like beautiful to the touch and no animals were harmed in the making of this coat. It's just so nice. Firstly, this color is a dream. This is sort of color that kind of is on par with black in terms of it goes with everything. I can't think of any color that this wouldn't go nicely on top of. It would go with absolutely everything. It's just a neutral, neutral color and I love it. The fabric, as I said, is just divine. It's so soft. It feels like, oh my gosh, it just feels like you want to cuddle clouds. Mm, so nice. I'm getting a bit OCT about a coat, but anyway. And I love this. You will see it in the try on clip. It's just, it looks so luxurious, I feel like. It just looks like a very luxurious coat. And if I saw this on someone and they styled it in the right way, I would never in a million years think that this was a high street coat um, because it is so beautifully made. For a faux fur coat, I think they've done a bloody fantastic job in making this look like luxury and making it look sophisticated and expensive and I actually got this in an extra small um it's actually quite oversized so you do not need to size up if you want it maybe a little bit oversized you could get one size up but like the small would have been fine on me but the extra small was more than big enough for me um I had plenty of room to breathe um it's nice and loose still it's not like um tapered in any way it's just loose hangs so beautifully and I just love it and this was 59.99 which I think is such an amazing price like it's a huge coat it's warm it's thick it's so like it's just so nicely made and to be honest this is what I mean like 60 pounds for this versus 80 pounds for a mini dress I don't really understand you know um I'm using my clothing here sorry didn't mean to strip for you all I just think this is a bargain if you don't already have your like signature autumn winter coat. Okay, so that is officially the end of this Zara haul. I really hope you guys liked the pieces that I picked out and the outfits that I put together. I really, really love the bits that I showed today and I really hope you guys like them as well. As always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to leave a comment down below which outfit was your favourite. Thank you all so, so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!